Okay, we're back. Time for a new episode of our Leaf Green Nuzlocke here. We just finished up a previous episode of Rolls Roulette. We're moving back into just a standard episode. And uh, trying to get, you know, further on in the game right now. We're working our way towards Rock Tunnel. We're getting our, our buddy Squash trained up here. Well, that hit hard. Jeez. Come on, Squash. Doing that damage. Nice. All right, Machop, I'm not feeling as positive about. <clears throat> I mean, one rock throw from a Geo dude did like, what was it, 18 health? So you figure a Karate Chop, a high critical hit ratio move, you know, might do some serious damage, so. Oh, dang it, I should have used my Aerial Ace, that's right. So in the last episode, we uh, went ahead and had Sriracha learn Aerial Ace, and uh, it was doing some work, so of that stab i think the stab bonus right now is really helping jeez it's really close to the next level where are you at 490 okay can't remember exactly, but I want to say there was like a random rare candy around here somewhere. Oh well. I also remember I skipped this trainer down here, so we're going to do this real quick and then we'll loop back. Alright, Squash, keep it up. Ooh, magnitude five, and not that strong. Eek. Come on, buddy, you got this. You'll be okay, you'll be okay. Ooh. Alright, I know you got this. I know, yeah, there you go. Magnitude nine. Crush me. Beautiful. Ooh, Onyx, okay. Definitely not going to risk that. Let's go ahead and switch out to Pineapple. Come on, pineapple. Nice. It's crit. There we go. Squash is a 24. Pineapple is right behind it. Sweet. So we'll loop back. We'll get that last trainer and then we'll move on to the next chunk. I think I can get a new encounter. In that grass patch I was right next to here in a second. Oh, 
Oh yeah, give me the monies. Give me the monies. Scattering those coins all over the place. Come on, give me money. Money, 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 money. Crit! Nice. Back to back crits. Awesome. Okay. Yeah, Route 10. This one I do think is a new encounter. Although, we already have this little guy. Gal. We also have Sandrew. Come on. Maybe not. I thought there was an encounter that we could get, but maybe I'm wrong. I'll try, uh, what, that was the third one? I'll try two more, and then we'll keep moving on. Oh, there it is. All right. So, yeah. I thought, I was pretty sure there was another encounter in here. Let's go ahead and give it a give it a ball. Perfect. We got ourselves a Voltor. I'm gonna give them a uh, sweet nickname. Obviously, was thinking about this while we were. Getting ready to catch. We're gonna go with our buddy Gumball here to stay with like the food type eating thing. Uh, naming trope, I guess. Nice, we got our friend Gumball here. Alright. So that means we get this nice little Pokemon Center. Nope, no, no, we're not talking again. Okay. Let's talk to these people real quick. I don't think anyone's going to give me anything, but you never know. This looks like one of Professor Oak's aids, so maybe... Have you got 20 species? I think I just got number 20. Everstone. Okay, so something useless. Got it. I know it's not useless, useless, but it's, 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 let's be honest here, I don't see myself using that really right now. Well, this little, this dude, heard there was ghosts hunting Lavender Town. Guess we'll find out, eventually. Okay, let's see. I know I have another trainer to face off against. Oops. Right here, so we'll go ahead and bring out bring out our buddy Bacon, who hasn't hasn't seen the light of day in a minute. Taking on this picnicker. Person that is enjoying a picnic. I kinda <laughs> when I was a kid I, I wanted them to like have the like the picnic people sitting on the ground, potentially with like, you know, one of those cliche red and white plaid blankets kind of thing. I always just looked at them and they're like, oh, that's a, gr a Girl Scout or a Boy Scout or, you know, something like that. Oh, look at me. I, I bumped Metal Claw seeing, you know, Clefairy as it is now, which is a fairy type and completely just going to do normal damage to this fairy right now. Hey... Yeah, I'll follow you, Clefairy. That's fine. 
Bacon, bacon is giving you full on attention right now. Can't you feel it? Just hot, hot ass attention. Yeah, apparently this uh, Clefairy is digging it and encoring my uh, my hot ass attention. Well, now it can be. It's a crit. Oh, uh, now it's taken out. All right, good job, Bacon. Nice, I didn't, I mean, lost some PP, but uh, didn't take any damage, so I'm just going to keep moving forward. Found another berry. Okay, so, I know how to get through this cave for the most part without, uh, without flash. But, I think for the interest of the people watching, we're going to go ahead and give, give somebody flash. There are only two people who can learn it. I really like the team, uh, the attacks that uh, Sriracha has, so we're going to look into Spinach here, maybe having Flash. Hopefully Spinach doesn't have some really cool moves. Alright, obviously keeping Vine Whip and Acid, so I think we'll go ahead and get rid of Growth. There's our dopey looking little, <laughs> little Spinach. But hey, don't underestimate spinach. We all know that uh, spinach will kick your ass if uh, if they get a chance. He's not afraid to throw down. All right, let's get a little little extra light here. Okay, moving forward. So we got a scientist below us. We got a random. There we go. I was gonna say I thought there was an item. Let's start with repel. I also. I've not gotten an encounter here yet, so we'll find out if that happens probably next time, honestly. Alright, oh, it's not a, it's a, it's a Pokemon Maniac. Looks like a Charizard. Has a Cubone. Ooh, I wonder if there's Cubone in this cave. I cannot remember, and that would be sick to get a Cubone. Um, yeah, Eggplant could do this. Yeah, I mean, you know, Cubone... The first generation, I, I loved a ton of the ground types. Like Sand Slash, Cubone, either of the Nittos, Rhydon, like these ground type Pokemon were some of my favorites. Ooh, it's hitting hard. Oh, but I gotta click it. Adios. Nice, okay. We got a slow poke to deal with, which is a water type, which is one of the few types that I am not really good at, and specifically a water psychic. This is a really bad combo. Um, luckily, I don't think it will know like a strong psychic move yet? Yeah, okay. I think it would have used confusion there if it knew it. So as always, relying on spinach to clean up the trash. Okay, we'll move forward a little bit. I might already have to go back and get potions. Oh, do we get an encounter? Nope. Sadly, we, uh, we already have caught this Glorified Pokemon. Our old buddy Tots. Another encounter. Do we get it? Do we get it? Yep. And there we go. So our encounter for the Rock Tunnel is going to be Machop. If this... Ooh, Bacon. Okay, well, I guess Bacon was just trying to speed up the process because I was going to say I might have to cut out us catching this Pokemon if it goes over time, but uh, Bacon wasn't having that. Okay, so what do we want to name Machop? I'm gonna say... I'm gonna go Turkey. So yeah, that's going to be it for the episode now. Uh, thanks for watching, and have a great day. Goodbye.